Hey, what's going on guys? Seha Man back with another review. And uh, actually today I'm doing a movie review. I'm going to do a quick little um, Iron, Man, uh, Iron Man 3 movie review. Um, it's not going to be really any spoilers. It's just going to be my thoughts on the movie. Well, I guess there might be a little bit of spoilers. I actually saw the movie uh, Thursday night, the night before the movie actually came out. Um, I got, I watched it on, uh, I watched it on 3D, and it was like a nine o'clock showing. And I was surprised that um, the theater I went to wasn't too far from my house. It was actually like empty. There was, there was probably like maybe, like maybe 15 to 20 people in the theater. So it got good seats and and whatnot. So overall, it was it was really cool because there wasn't that many people uh, inside inside the uh, the theater. But um, my thoughts on the movie. Uh, it was pretty good. Um, the only thing that was upsetting, I know a lot of people got upset with the uh, twist in the movie, and I'm going to give you the spoiler right now, I guess, uh, is that the Mandarin obviously isn't the Mandarin. It's, um, shit, I forgot that guy, I cussed, sorry guys, I forgot that guy's name uh, who ends up becoming the Mandarin. Totally forgot the guy's name. Uh, guy Pierce. Guy Pierce, is that his name? Guy Pierce, yeah, he ends up becoming the, the Mandarin, the actual guy who supposedly the Mandarin isn't the Mandarin? He's just an actor. Uh, it was a little, it was a little upsetting. I mean, I can understand where comic fans would get upset uh, about that. You know, him not being the Mandarin, which was kind of, in my opinion, I kind of found it. If you really think about it, I kind of found it kind of pointless. I mean, if if they were gonna do that, then they might as well have just not have used the Mandarin. They could have just used some other, like terrorist or something, and just you know make it seem like he was the main bad guy. And you know they they could have worked it like that rather than use a Mandarin because I'm pretty sure they got a lot of hi people hyped up, you know, thinking he was going to use his rings and everything, but it wasn't like that at all. And uh, another thing that was kind of upsetting was the the trailers. The trailers for the movie made it made it seem like it was going to be uh, like a really dark kind of serious movie. And there's little like parts of the movie where it's kind of serious, but for the majority of it. It's a, it's kind of like a comedy. It's pretty much like a like comedy. It's got a lot a lot of humor in it. But you know what? I, I'm not complaining. I liked the movie for what it was. I wasn't going in there expecting it to be like a, um, a hardcore like comic movie, like comic accurate movie. I knew I knew already expecting it wasn't going to be like comic book accurate because I know a lot of people uh, were saying like where's the rest of the Avengers and stuff? How come they didn't come in? How come there's no cameos? But you know what? It's an Iron Man movie. I mean, if you read the comics, not all the time is there going to be like the Hulk's going to be in there or, or Captain America or something. But you know, it's cool. I mean, you got to have an, your own Iron Man movie. It's got to just be Iron Man. Um, another another thing that was kind of upsetting is that uh, War Machine or Iron Patriot, whatever you want to call him, didn't really get to shine in this movie either. We didn't really get to see him battle. Uh, we didn't get to see him do like a lot of um, uh, little you know action scenes and stuff. But it was still cool. It was still cool. The humor was good. Um, it, it, the um, actors, I thought the actors all did well, it, it was good, it, the movie was over two hours and to be honest with you, I did not get bored at all, it seriously didn't drag for me, it, the two hours flew by, I mean, it, it didn't even seem like it was two hours, I enjoyed it that much, it was, it was a good movie, it was funny, um, there were some scenes that were pretty serious that were pretty good, it was really good, um, you get to see Pepper Potts in the, um, in the suit, and uh, and the Iron Man suit and stuff and the ex the whole uh, extremist you know thing was 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 done pretty was done pretty well but again whew, adjust the camera here but again you know don't go don't go into this movie expecting it to be like a whole like comic book accurate um, just you know accept it for what it is it's a fun movie um, that's that's pretty much it I don't really got much to say about it I just I just wanted to to get a little video out there saying that I did see Iron Man three it was a great movie. It, to me, it's it was better than part two, um, and but not is not better than part one. I mean, part one obviously is the best one, but I can see why I can see why a lot of uh, people got upset with this third one. But still a good movie, definitely worth checking out. Uh, that's it, guys. Just wanted to get this quick little video out there just to give you my thoughts on Iron Man three. And see this, oh, my phone went off. See this black background going on here. I'm still working on it. Uh, this is basically going to be for my um, uh, little vlogs that I'm, that I'm going to be doing at the end of um, every month. So I'm still kind of setting it up. It's not on there perfectly yet. This is kind of like a test thing. So I figured, you know, why not do the Iron Man 3, my quick little review on Iron Man 3. But that's pretty much it, guys. So uh, definitely check out Iron Man. 
Um, if you guys haven't seen it, <laughs> I just spoiled it for you, and then I'm sorry. Uh, I, I warned you there's spoilers ahead. But let me know. Let me know what you guys thought of the movie. If you guys liked it, what you guys thought about it, what you guys thought about the end credit scene, and um, um, that's it. That's it. Um, so stay tuned, guys. Got a lot of reviews coming up. Uh, thank you again for watching. Thanks for everybody for subbing, and uh, we'll see you guys soon. My camera's about to die, so you guys take care.